morning guys welcome back to another vlog it is currently half nine in the morning so i've taken the kids to school um today i'm going to well i've got to go to sports up i've got to pick up some some bits from there a uh, skipping rope and maybe a dumbbell and um an exercise ball uh, for sabrina as she needs to exercise in it for for the pregnancy to, to be easier so i need to definitely pick that up that's the most important thing um, also, we may go and visit Sabrina's cousin, she, she just had um, a baby, so we may be going down there to visit her, just waiting for the confirmation text back, and um, yeah, uh, I'm going to get uh, my circuit in early in the morning today, but before that I'm going to do the Sally Up push up challenge, because I've seen it on, on the, the internet, and I'll see how tough it really is and see how far I can get, so that'll be the first thing I'm going to do. So I'm going to prepare for that and um, the next uh, scene you'll see me on is me doing the Sally Up push-up challenge. So see you in a bit. Peace. Seriously, I think I've got two minutes, two minutes, 20, something like that. I have to count back when I re look at the video, but that's intense, man. I might incorporate that every other day and see how much improvement I get, but that burns, man. That really burns, seriously, that was hard. But yeah, that's the Sally Up Challenge done. Hope you enjoyed it. So guys, just getting into the garden now. Um, yeah, just got to prep my circuit. Then um, I'll see if I can put this camera in the angle because I've got no one to video me today. So I can put it in the angle, see, so you can see my circuit. So give me a sec. So that's my circuit prep, it's going to be the same as it was the other day, um, 45 seconds or 15 seconds recovery, um, go around 4 to 5 times. So yeah, that's my my go-to circuit hit, Shred, it burns fat and last night, we had um, guests over last night and um, the dessert came out and uh, I didn't have the best times eating wise, I still just managed to stand to my calorie intake because I had a lot of calories. Uh, left over, but this morning I just felt sluggish because I didn't eat great last night, so I'm gonna torch that. So 
so I can feel better after this session so I'll see you in a bit. Yeah guys, so that was my circuit. Um, like I said, I had no one to film me, so I, it was on um, a tripod in one position, but um, yeah, you saw what, what I done. Um, I actually done one minute on each station with a 20 second rest, um, and I went around five times. So it was a good intense uh, circuit, I'm tired now. Just gonna grab a shower. Um, yeah, grab a shower now, and uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna go upstairs, because Oh, that's a bit dark. Give me a second. Yeah, gonna grab a shower now. Go upstairs. Uh, see if Sabrina's got the text back from her cousin. See if we're gonna go around right there. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna freshen up now. Then um, I'll see you guys in a bit. Peace. Right, so we're all ready. And we're gonna go to, um, we'll go sports soccer first. And then we're gonna go and see Sabrina's cousin and her new baby. So that's the plan. That's the plan. Yeah, so it's just the three of us, as the other three are in school. So we've got to make this quick because we've still got to get back to, to pick them up. So off we go. Effective. So I've got it. Think it exercise ball. A bit too expensive in there for me, but um, yes, yeah, so I've got what I need to get. Uh, gonna shoot back off now. See Sabrina's cousin. They're a bit funny with you recording there, so I tried to slide to get a bit, but they're a bit funny. So. Uh, Got it. All I've got is skipping rope. Oh. Um, they're funny if you're recording in there, man. Oh, so are they? They're looking at you and then I can see them like talking and that. So I just tried to slightly um, show me you picking up this. Oh. Yeah, it is what it is. But yeah, let's go and see Ash now. See you guys in a bit. Uh, we just got to come out and um, see Ashley's baby girl, Harley. We didn't want to vlog it because we wanted some privacy time. And she only gave birth what, four days ago? Yeah. So to bring out a camera and put it in people's faces, that's not the one. So we had some quiet time without the camera. But we're just leaving now. We've got to head to the shops quickly. Yeah, the shops, pick up a few bits, then get back and pick up the kids um, from school. So we'll probably see you next back at home anyway. So we've just been pulled over and must remove the tints on the car. Yeah, we're back for over 12 years. Over 12 years and we were driving 30 miles an hour. So there's no way that the tints could have been seen. Um, Thank <laughs> you. 
I was actually so frightened because I've never been pulled over. It's ridiculous. Really. 12 years. So that guy to see us from the angle we were. I'm scared to lift the camera up too much. He must be eagle eye. It's, so it's, it's covered in police, so like that's why yeah. the angle's not great. Yeah. Literally covered in police. It is what it is. There's no point getting pissed off about it. Ain't gonna spoil my day. Stay positive. So. This is unreal. Covered in police. Shocking. That is so frightening. Oh, what is it? So yeah, literally driving out now. If you see all these cars coming in here, are just being pulled by this man over there. All we did was try and visit a new baby that's been born <laughs> and we got pulled over and the police officer said that we didn't get the car from a dealer which we did we got it from a famous dealer in Essex that's always on telly all the time, <laughs> all the time. it's like saying uh, it's just it's just absolute nonsense isn't it it's just, it's just. It's just annoying, but if you let them little things annoy you through your day, there'll be more and more annoying yeah, things that true. build up. So it is what it is. It didn't really bother me. It wasn't even bad. You could see straight in the car, but obviously rules and regulations. There's no, We're point, arguing. The right lane, there's no point arguing with the police. That was so frightening, all. though. I was literally so nervous. Were you? <laughs> yeah. Because I didn't know what they were going to say because they I said, believe. do you know why you've been pulled over? I was thinking, no. No, when he done that, I was thinking, pulled over. I was like, obviously, no, I don't know why I've been pulled over. Like, it doesn't make any sense why we've been pulled over. But, obviously, Eagle Eye, Constable Eagle Eye, saw our tints from an impossible angle. And then they said, yeah, we've got to take the tints off. So, I had to take them off. Not really bothered, to be fair. It's only the, this one and, and the one on that side. But, I've got some pictures. I couldn't film at the time because... There's about 100 of them looking up. Yeah, it don't bother me. Hi guys, we've been back home quite a while now. Picked up the kids from school. It's currently coming to half past five. I have a client at six o'clock, so I've got myself ready. i um, going to head over to the park, uh, get all the equipment set out, and then wait for the client to come. So that's what I'm going to shoot off to now. So let's go. Alright guys, quick question, yeah? Are you as lazy as me where every single time I get in my car, well not every single time, majority of the time, your petrol light is on? Every single time, like, the thing is I go past um, petrol stations and I think, you know what, don't worry, I can get there or I wake up early and do it in the morning and I never do. Does anyone else do that? Like, I don't know what my problem is. One, there's going to be one day where I'm going to get caught up I'm gonna get um I'm gonna run out of petrol and I'm gonna be stranded. It's gonna be my own fault. But um yeah, I always I always do it. Always it's, it's always it lives there. I put petrol in, I burn it out, and then I can't bother to get any petrol, I always chance it. But yeah, that's just one of the things that I do. Um it's not good, it's not good for the car either. But I can I can just be lazy sometimes man. But oh well. Right, so I'm here guys, um, nice and early. I'm not going to film the session again because I'm not going to put another parent's child on camera and uh, yeah, I don't feel comfortable with that. I wouldn't really want that. So uh, yeah, I'm going to go and do this session and um, I'll catch up with you lot after, in a bit. So I'm back from coaching. I'm tired today. I've come back and the wife, here she is, hey. has made me this oh look at that look at that so i'm gonna box this off guys hope you enjoyed the vlog and i'll see you when i see you peace out